How can you help the brain repair itself and reconnect after a stroke? Let us first see how the brain can repair itself after an injury. For years and years, we were told that we develop a fixed number of brain cells when we are born that will just die in our lifetime, losing thousands and thousands of neurons. In the 1990s, scientists have proven that this is not strictly true. Neurogenesis is the formation of new brain cells which occurs also in the adult brain and results in the production of new neurons. We now know that after an injury, the brain attempts to repair itself, but this is often only partial, allowing only incomplete recovery. After a stroke, neurogenesis will start the proliferation of neuronal precursors or progenitor cells that have the potential to develop into new brain cells needed to repair the brain. These progenitor cells result from the differentiation of stem cells present in some parts of our brain. They have the potential to later become fully functional neurons, which may take over the neurons that have died. But we know that the conditions and environment around the area of the brain damaged by a stroke is not ideal. And so those new cells actually cannot easily incorporate and become neurons on their own. Obviously, one of the main questions that scientists have to solve is how to amplify these natural processes for increasing the number of new neurons and ensuring that they become incorporated functionally in the brain circuitry. Another priority is to ensure that as many cells as possible will survive in the brain. The healthy cells around the area of stroke will provide an important resource within the area of the damage that can help in the repair process. Call neuroplasticity together with the new neurons generated by neurogenesis. In and around the area of stroke, there are a lot of cells that are surviving but starve for oxygen and nutrients called the ischemic penumbra. The sooner the supply of oxygen and nutrients can be re-established, the more likely those cells will survive. Scientists continuously search for better ways to harness this phenomenon and encourage greater proliferation and migration of new cells to areas that have been damaged in the brain. In the hope of restoring physical functions that were lost because of a stroke and other brain injuries. Now, let us look at how we can help the brain repair itself and reconnect further. The most common way to enhance the brain's potential to repair itself and reconnect after an injury is to stimulate it by performing rehabilitation exercises. Are there other ways to improve and amplify the repair process and help the brain to reconnect? NeuroAid is a natural product. Its neuroprotective and neurorestorative properties have been demonstrated in animal studies and cell cultures. NeuroAid has been shown to enhance the natural processes of neuronal repair, neuroplasticity, and neurogenesis through synergistic mechanisms of action. It stimulates the production of new neurons, increases the number of connections between neurons, and makes neurons stronger. All these facilitating fuller recovery. This study compares neuronal cells treated with NeuroAid to non-treated neuronal cells. At day one, cell cultures were similar between the two groups. After 14 days, however, cells treated with NeuroAid show a higher survival rate and are healthier with better cell-to-cell -cell connections. In the clinical setting, there are numerous studies showing how NeuroAid can help in the recovery of stroke patients. NeuroAid has been shown to enhance motor recovery after stroke. The improvement of motor function with NeuroAid can be seen as early as the first month of treatment and continue to do so until the third month of treatment and beyond. NeuroAid has also been shown to improve independence after stroke. In patients with a confirmed moderately severe impairment, the chance of achieving independence is increased by 63% with NeuroAid after three months of treatment compared to the control group. In addition, NeuroAid was shown to significantly reduce early cardiovascular events and deaths by half on top of standard treatments during the first three months after a stroke. A large number of clinical data and biological blood tests and several years of usage in many countries are available to document the safety of NeuroAid in post-stroke recovery. The benefit-risk ratio of NeuroAid is high. Several thousands of patients have already used NeuroAid in the post-stroke recovery phase. Find out if NeuroAid is right for you. Learn more about how you can help your brain reconnect.
visit our website, discuss this with your doctor, and ask us about NeuroWave.